Hi, Chino Borges here with The Wild Self, reporting from Lake Tahoe, California. I want to talk about this idea of putting your identity at risk. You will notice a lot of the images at The Wild Self involve seeing people, including myself, in a range of identities. Images that range from me being out in no man's land, way out in the middle of the backcountry, in the desert, alone, to being at an art salon in a heavily urbanized area of San Francisco called the Mission District, dressed up in all kinds of funky attire, some of it very feminine, clownish, funky, face paint. And yet, both of those, both of those contexts provide the same experience for me. It's interesting. Back country and front country, both of these contexts allow me to put this mask, this Gino mask, to take it off and put it aside. For instance, in nature, in nature, whenever it just whenever you're out in the natural world, especially when you're out there in that wide open space and you're all alone and you're just hearing your heartbeat, the ego just sort of dissolves like butter in the sun. It just whoosh, it's so pretty and so nice and you just feel elevated and recharged you don't even have to try you just step out there and this social identity that you have to service and fill up and put all this work into and you you don't need to and you realize like wow there's this buoyancy that that occurs as soon as you get to take off that mask what we call identity or persona the same thing goes for when when you see me with costumes and face paint whether it's a cowboy hat whether it's feminine clothes, it's the same, it's the same exercise. It allows me to take off the Gino mask and play out a character. Play out this character and as a result I get the buoyancy of these little hidden parts of the self that don't get to surface in the context of a mortal existence where shame, honor, judgment, guilt, everything you can imagine, pressure, the pressure to conform, all comes into place that rigidifies and reifies the mask of persona. And that's why I love the Trickster Salon and the role that Stephanie Muffson has, has encouraged me to take on, the role of MC, is allowing me to articulate this message. But I say again, these images that you see me in, whether it's way out in the backcountry, in the natural world, or dressed up, it's really the same thing. I believe that once once the status quo of persona ends, the real quest of understanding myself in, in, in terms of its sheer potential starts occurring.